Hello, my name is Edward and I'm the president of Valarm. In this video, you'll see how to share your Valarm sensor data using the Valarm Tools Cloud APIs. Currently, you can publish your sensor data in JSON, KML, CSV, and GeoRSS formats. We are adding the CAP format next, as well as other customer requests. Once you're logged in to tools.valarm.net, go to the Device Manager page to view all of your Valarm devices. From this page, pick the device you want to share publicly. Now that you are viewing this device's info, you can turn on public feeds by checking the checkbox and then clicking Save. Once the device has been updated, you'll see a Generate URLs button. Click the Generate URLs button to launch the Valarm dialog for generating shareable API URLs. Based on your custom parameters and settings, the generated API URL will be updated. You can choose the Query API to specify a from and to date range, or use the latest API to return only the most recent sensor data. You can choose which output formats you would like, either JSON, CSV, KML, or GeoRSS. Specify the maximum amount of results you'd like returned, and then choose a starting and ending date. You can also specify what kind of trigger types you'd like in your data, such as sensor data collected at regular clock intervals or sensor thresholds, like a maximum CO2 air quality alert. Under Trigger Type, you can choose specifically which trigger you want in your output data, such as a minimum temperature or humidity, a speeding alert, or excessive gases or chemicals, using things like 4 to 20 milliamp sensors. Once you've chosen what you want in your output, then you can copy and paste the generated API URL into your destination of choice, like the Esri GeoEvent processor or the ArcGIS online platform. You can also use these Valarm APIs to embed or mash up your sensor data in another website of your design. Please don't hesitate to contact us at info at if you have any questions, comments, or suggestions for another video.